Most political lesbian aesthetic in the 70s and 80s was sometimes known as the dyke uniform. It was based in androgyny and included jeans, t-shirts, flat shoes, etc. This was popular among lesbian feminists, but other lesbians were excluded from this style no matter how lesbian or feminist they may be. Butch and Femme has a long tradition in lesbian culture and style, but at this time it became unfashionable and downright stigmatised. The idea was that butchers and femmes were replicating heterosexual relationship dynamics, which was not the case. This was also the time of what's known as the lesbian sex wars. On one side were the lesbian feminists, and on the other, lesbians who would dress in leather. A leather jacket was particularly controversial, and lesbians might not be allowed into community spaces if they were wearing one. Lesbian feminism was also largely a white movement. Black lesbians often felt unrepresented by its dress code, and separate black lesbian groups formed. If you want to read more about this, visit my blog, dressingdykes.com.